Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a part two video for the latest OpenXR settings. So I decided to fly a Boeing 787-10 Dreamliner over New York City um, in VR. Here's some screenshots of my VR settings in game. They're slightly different than they were yesterday because of obviously the airliner is more demanding. Most things are set to high. I could set the render scaling at 100, but um, I really don't think it's, as, it's quite as smooth as 80. Uh, so it's a personal preference that it's uh, 80 rather than 100. I also want to show you my WMR settings. Um, so what you do is just go to the Mixed Reality Portal and click on Settings. And I just go straight to Headset Display. And you can see I've got uh, Adjust Level of Detail and Quality of Effects in the Mixed Reality Home is set to High. Change App Window Resolution is 1080. Uh, changing the settings an experience of the WMR is uh, let windows decide. Resolution is best quality. Adjust frame rate is 90 hertz. I've got the calibration set here to default. And I actually like to have the manually, I actually like to have the input manually switched uh, between the headset and the desktop. So here we are approaching New York City in the distance there. Uh, so we're sitting in the cockpit, great views, uh, first of all, so if we look to the left and the right, there's no kind of stuttering, it's completely smooth. Just as smooth as in the Icon A5 last night. The clarity is so good, so this is looking out the window on my, on the, my side here. And then you can see the cabin and everything. The slight shaking you're getting is just from the recording of the VR, but honestly it's so smooth. So as we approach Manhattan here, you can see the frame rate is fluctuating um, around between around 18 to 21, 22, which is low frame rate, but it's so smooth thanks to OpenXR settings now, now being applied. It's really great. Honestly, I'm getting nothing. I'm getting no interference, no flashing, no stuttering, no artifacts either, no, nothing. I can't believe it. So I'll be definitely going to be flying some more airliners now after experiencing this. But yeah, so I'm just going to let you guys uh, experience and see for yourselves this amazing updated tool in action. As always, guys, if you like the content, please like and subscribe. I appreciate your time and thanks for watching. I look forward to making another video soon. Take care and stay safe.